Uh, hey. You're the one that eliminated the one decent member of my team. I'll barely be able to get through to the next round. I mean, I know I'm good at this, but I'm not that good. Hey, no hard feelings. I didn't know what I'd gotten into. Let's just move past this. No. I will eliminate you next round and make you suffer. It'll be fun for me. Next round. If I don't get you, one of the gladiators will. <sighs> you haven't been here long, so you wouldn't know. But the gladiators are trained for everything. And they are completely under Hadrian's control. Good luck, Em. I know that the best person will win. Seriously? You know you're looking at the best person. I feel kind of bad for you. Most of us got snatched against our wills, but you got tricked into coming willingly. That old builder should have told you these games were impossible. Looks like Tim won. Yeah, Tim. Yeah, well, good luck with getting home. There, that should be enough for a table. Aha! That's some fine crafting. Let's make some food. Boom! Bread! Now I should be able to get my friends back. Um, hello? Hey, face me. Got some bread for you. Bread, huh? <laughs> it's not cake, but face meat is starving. Mmm, it's so warm. Oh, and full of carbs. Mmm, fresh bread. Please get my friends. <laughs> face meat appreciates the politeness. Hang on. Hey, Petra. Hey, glad to see you already figured out the whole nether portal thing. Lucas and Ivor should be right out. One of those huge guys is getting them for me. Nice, nice. It seems like we keep ending up in situations. First with Palma, now with that stupid sploof game. Well, what I'm trying to say is, thanks. You know, don't make this awkward. It was just on my mind. And... Hey, of course I saved you, okay? You're one of my best friends. Well, I just hope Ivor isn't too jealous. I'm glad you're with me in this, Petra. Me too. Here! Oh! Oh, response! Jesse, man, is it good to see you. You too, Lucas. And Ivor. Uh, what are you wearing? Right. Shut up! My outfit breathes wonderfully. Anyway, how's it been going out here? You, uh, you don't have our stuff by any chance, do you? He's worried about his diary! I'm working on that. It's tricky, though. Well, don't beat around the bush. What has Harper gotten us wrapped up in? Yeah, Harper is a tricky one. As long as we stick together, it's gonna be fine. We'll either get the Atlas and go home, or... We'll be stuck in the nether together, forever. That is not reassuring, Jesse. Hey, Jesse, I need to talk. <laughs> it's pretty bad in there, Jesse. They don't even do anything to keep the pigmen away, so they just uh, stare at you while you mine. It's been terrible. And we weren't in there that long. Lucas, I'm sorry. We can't just leave. We made a deal. We have two more games to compete in. Well, hopefully we can get that over with quick. Apparently this guy Tim did it. That's true. He's all they talk about in the mines. 
Guess he won the games a long time ago and got all of his team home. They say he was three blocks tall and that he carried his entire team across the finish line. Yeah, it's super fishy. Well, you're out of those mines now. According to Harper, until our entire team is eliminated, you're allowed to stay here in the village. That's right. Your friends weren't supposed to go to the mines yet. I am sincerely sorry about that. Jesse, this is Otto, my old friend. Like I said, he may be able to help. So you're the one who's supposed to help us? Well, I'll enforce the rules at any rate. If that helps you, then uh, can't be games without rules. <laughs> Harper's been filling me in about you. From the story she's told, I'm impressed. You might actually make it to the top. In fact, you're the most exciting thing to come to this place in a long time. A real wild card. Yeah, I think you might be a real Tim in the making. Yep, a real Tim. Really interesting, you being here. I can feel change in the air. Tim, please. I can do anything he can do better. Well, you might just be right about that, Jesse. I'm rooting for you, kid. Just don't disappoint me. Can we trust him, Harper? Who knows? Otto's been doing this forever. At least he seemed interested. Anyway, dorms are over there. You got a big day tomorrow, Jesse. Oh, that sounds awesome. Can't wait to just sit for a little while. And in the morning, I'm winning and getting us all out of here. I wonder what the next event will be. Hopefully nothing too deadly. <laughs> I'm sorry, but I can't take you seriously looking like that. It breathes. Wonderfully! Hello, competitors, and welcome to the next day of the games. <laughs> it's gonna be a hot one. Woo! Yes, it is, Adrian. And how are our teams looking, Otto? Well, Mevia, purple, green, and yellow are still making a strong showing. But after yesterday's performance in Spleef, I'm afraid to say that the red team has been completely eliminated. Oh, I guess it's back to the mines for them. <laughs> and of course, about our plucky newcomers. Otto, shut up. We don't need to hear about them. Well, for everyone else, don't forget to be like Tim out there! <laughs> Wonder how this is gonna go. These other losers don't look so tough. Yep, it's gonna be a good one. I can feel it. All right, I can get behind that kind of optimism. No idea what this event is. I'm sure we'll kick butt. All right, competitors, the next event is almost upon us. Time to head to the starting line. Starting line, huh? A race! We've totally got this! <laughs> Got this, huh? Boom! Surprise locker room visit! Ha! How we doing, everybody? It's Hadrian! And here are the newcomers that everyone's been talking about since their <laughs> explosive debut in Spleef. Tell me, champ, what's on your mind as you approach the next challenge? Make sure you smile when that spotlight's on you. I'm just looking forward to a fair contest where the best person wins. Well, listen to this little pillar of nobility, huh? Don't you worry. That's what these games are all about. Just ask Tim. I admire your confidence, Jesse, but I must ask, what makes you think you can win when so many others have failed? Huh? Do you really think you're special? Whatever you're throwing at us can't be any worse than the other stuff we've already survived. Oh, really? Because it seems like two members of your team have already been eliminated. Yeah, and there's two left. More than enough to win this. Yes, perhaps we should just get on with this. <laughs> what a lovely day for a game. Jesse, good luck out there. I'm sure you'll be great, but, uh, well, everyone could always use a little dose of luck, right? Thanks, Em. Good luck to you, too. Of course. I saw what you could do in Spleef. Then you made that deal with Hadrian, and I thought, whew, 
An enemy of my enemy is my friend. M might be up to something. So, uh, yeah. How about we work together on this? I could use an ally. And you could use my help. <sighs> Come on, Jesse. I'm trying to help you out here. Like a mutual agreement. How's that gonna work? A bigger group has a better chance of getting past the gladiators. Trust me. In the middle of the race is a part with tons of gladiators. That's when we should all team up. Defeat them, then race to the finish. Well, what do you say? Unless you don't want the help of a former gladiator. I mean, that's okay too. I'm sure you'll be fine. I'm gonna stick with my team, and you should stick with yours. Fine, I'll do that. Competitors, to the starting line. See you at Gladiator Junction. We don't need them. They'll just hold us back. I'm ready for this. Those gladiators are going down. Hint, it's gonna involve a lot of punching and kicking and all around awesomeness. Give them all you got, Petra. I've been waiting all day for you to say that. Jesse, it is a total bummer that we are not going to be able to, you know, work together. Sorry you're going to lose now. I still think you're awesome, though. Competitors, on your mark! 